Hey everyone, it's John Hancock again with Walnut Ridge Family RV, and today is Walkthrough Wednesday. Today we're looking at the 2021 Puma 32 RBFQ. We're going to go from the rear to the front, and I'm going to show you some of the features about this great camper so that you can kind of get a really good idea before you get here of some of the features that it does have. First of all, Let's talk about a spare tire. Always good to have a spare tire for your camper. Some makes, some places will remove that spare tire, try to charge you a little bit more for it. Uh, we don't. It's right here on the Puma, and you can count on it to be there when you need it. Also, has a roof ladder. Clue number one that a walk, roof is walkable and structurally good is there's a ladder on the back of the camper. So if there's no ladder, you need to ask that question every time. Outside kitchen, check this out. It has the Greystone griddle. How about that? Bacon, eggs, pancakes, hamburgers, you name it. You stir fry, you can cook that on there. That'll come in real handy. It has a real sink. It's not a sink that you fill and you toss out. It actually has a drain that goes to it as well. Microwave. Puma's one of the few that put a microwave in the outside kitchen. And you might find that actually, if you're feeding a lot of people, you might find that pretty handy. You've got your little utensil drawer right here. More storage right here in the Puma. And they put storage up there as well. Instead of having that little half-size fridge, they've got the full thing here. And if you'll look up, it has cover. The door actually doubles as cover from the sun, from rain, whatever you might need it. But it's right there. Uh, coming down through, we have a power awning, of course. It is power in and out. Outside speakers that are tied into your internal radio. Um, this is your black tank flush. Here's an outside shower. So if the kids get salt, sand on their feet, you can spray them off. If you need to wash Fido before he goes in there, maybe you got a porcupine or a skunk or something, there's your outside shower for that. TV bracket, TV hookups on the outside. So some people like to bring out, even if they don't use the bracket, they'll put it on a a table here, put the awning out, and they can watch the game, watch the race, uh, watch whatever they're into, and still have the TV out there to do exactly that. Coming on down through here, this is your fresh tank fill. So if you happen to be one of those boondock and you haul water, that's where we fill that. This is your water heater right here. 32 RBFQ with the extended season package. So if you're going out there early in the season, late in the season, during the off season, then this has the sealed and heated underbelly and you're gonna like that an awful lot because that'll protect your plumbing. Big grab handle, upgraded flip up steps. Now I always tell people, here's a nice little tip. The ladies will appreciate this. If you're gonna have flip up steps, which you can't beat, the feet are telescoping so they set in, in an uneven territory. Um, what you can do is put a whisk broom up here because here's why. You want to broom that off before everybody gets, after everybody gets done using it and you get ready to go home. Before you flip them steps up with all that stuff on there, whisk broom that off. You'll, you'll appreciate the fact you did do that. We have ac access to outside storage right here, which is actually also part of your inner closet in the master. There's a washer and dryer hook up in there. So you're going to love that as well. We've got 30 pound propane cylinders, power tongue jack. You know, at Walnut Ridge, no extras. You're gonna get a battery, you're gonna get the propane purged and filled. It'll be ready to go camping when you leave here. All right, how about that? Now we're gonna go check out the inside. All right, so continuing on, we're in the master bedroom now. I mean, you wanna talk about a master bedroom. This thing's got space everywhere. You got storage up above here. You've got 110 connections on both sides of the bed. Look at this wardrobe. It is a monster wardrobe. It's very deep. You have your hanging rack already on there, a shelf on top, plenty of space for your shoes, and just store just about anything that you'd like to store in there with four do doors to go with it. Now, when we're talking about storage, another thing we don't want to forget, look at the storage underneath that bed. There's your spare tire cover, by the way, so that comes with it. Don't forget that. And then we have a built-in chest of drawers right here. You're going to love that. Look at this closet. Washer and dryer can go in there. So if you're going to put this, and a lot of people do use these as lake places, they'll put it in one spot. You can put the washer and dryer in there and do some laundry while you're there. TV backers right here. So there's a hard surface back there where we put the TV bracket and your hookups are right here so they're all not dangling down the wall. That's ideal. And then one of the things that Puma did that we love is we have roller shades. Roller shades are the best. Remember the crinkly ones that only last two years and then you can't get them to 
accordion up, well, you don't have to worry about that. Roller shades are the best. And we certainly thank Puma because we don't want to sell the best. And that'll start there. All right, let's check out the main living area. Now, this thing is spacious. It's huge. So if you have a big family, this is one you're going to want to go with. U-shaped dinette, first of all, with storage down below there. So if you look here, you'll see... Simply go, get you a couple tubs at your favorite big box store, slide your stuff in there and slide it back out. We have a jackknife sofa that has hidden storage below it as well. So you want to talk about storage, you're trying to make sure that they take advantage of every square inch of storage that they might be able to get you. How about a 10 cubic foot 12 volt refrigerator? You see how big that is? I mean, if you're going to have a big camper with lots of bunks, you're going to need a big big refrigerator to take care of everybody stainless steel package here here and here so it all blends very good puma has done a wonderful job of making this thing just absolutely beautiful solid countertops right there they're underlit by leds we have also a fireplace now before you say i don't need a fireplace it's just it's not just for pretty there's 5,000 btus of electric heat in there and if you'd like to go ahead and have the campground Pay for your electric while you heat your camper with it instead of burning up your own propane. Boom, 5,500 BTUs of electric heat. Big TV comes with the Puma, so you don't even have to go shopping for one of those as well. All right, now we're going to check out the bunk room. This bunk room, well, we can put some youngins back here. So we have a bunk up here that is currently tied up in case you want to use that for a sofa because the TV goes opposite of that. But then you pull down the bunk, hit your light, and then they have their bed ready. Now, that pins up out of the way. And then the bunk, the bed, the sofa, I should say, flops into two more beds right there. And then we have another bed here. And then we have a bunch of storage right here and right there underneath the ladder. And the ladder is permanently fixed in here, won't come out. And you don't have to worry about finding it. Maybe the kids won't use it for a raft going down the river. The TV goes here. The hookups are up underneath here again to keep the wiring up and out of your way. So, going back into the main living area, it has the big stainless steel under counter sink. They give you this as sort of a strainer right there to deal with the single. I mean, but here's, here's the deal. On these, it was the women that wanted the single sink. Not all, but some. And so that's why they went to that. Women have a lot to do with how RVs are designed. They want to make mama happy. And in the bathroom, we have a big corner shower. We have a vanity. We have storage below and above. Instead of just having a mirror on the wall, they've actually turned that into a medicine cabinet, so you can use that as well. Big corner shower, lots of room for everybody. And this, of course, will break down into a bed as well. So if you really need to sleep a lot, you got people coming, grandma, grandpa, cousins, you can accommodate them with this one. Anyway, this has to be our number one Puma bunkhouse seller. Um, you need to come see it. Walnut Ridge Family RV will be delighted to have you. And again, no extras, battery comes with it. Propane comes with it. We'd really like to see you come by. Looking is still free. I'm John Hancock. This is another Walkthrough Wednesday. Come see us.